And we're go. I not ah. recording this on a capture card, not on an emulator, because I really want to listen to the soundtrack. And ZSNES does not uh, play this game well. I found out that the hard way. So we're gonna let's play. Oh, okay, intro. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm level 27 Marker Man, and this is Let's Play Pokemon. Da da. This is Let's Play Super Mario RPG. As voted for by Gold Bleed Gamer 1. I'm gonna be taking on the game and beating it. And as for this, alright, first thing, we're gonna start a new game. This is gonna be approximately 100%. I've played this game a lot before. It's one of my childhood games. Is there an arrow here? Okay. I'm just gonna call myself the name I usually call myself in my Let's Plays. Man! Although my real name is revealed here, but let's be honest. If you watch my races, you know my real first name. Ah, uh, what peace and serene entity. Uh, yes, peace and serenity. We've already seen this before. <coughs> I shot this in my intro, man! Oh no! Bowser kidnapped the princess! Again? After conquering the seven worlds, Mario makes it to Bowser's castle. See? He just did it off screen. Alright, let's show off a battle. Oh man, three of them. Now, the way this works is you have to press the button that you want to use, the action you want to use, and then you can do it. You have to press that button again to do it. If you press B now, you will, um... Can it's cancel for a for the, an A action. A is attack. So no, well, I didn't time that well. Yeah, there are also things called timed hits. Like if you press the A button right when he does his first punch, he'll do a second punch and do more, a lot more damage. All same with you can even do the same thing with attacking. When you, right when you're hit, you can perform press the A any button really. I think I can press the Y button. Yeah, you can press any button for time tense. I just usually prefer A for attacks, B for defending. Or I'm just gonna stick because you don't need to fight any of these guys. They do nothing. And if you time it really well, you do take no damage whatsoever. This is an RPG, very classic, only you decide everything one turn at a time. Instead of having your whole team go. And with the timed hits, that's kind of good a good way to do it. <coughs> this is a very generous RPG, but it's also the, the meanest Mario RPG on beginners. In my opinion. Beginners will have a lot of trouble with this game. Well, I think. Unless they take help from a guide. Or this Let's Play. Wait, what were we looking for? There's Bowser! He's on the chandelier! This is one of my favorite... I'm gonna be honest about this, actually. This is one of my... Okay. Oh, Bowser! Whee! For the great beyond! Alright, so this is what, actually, this fight against Bowser, now you can attack Bowser, but you really want to attack Clink Clink. And we're going to use his special attack, Jump. Aha! Avoided your spike! The Fire Breath Bowser? Well, this is, in my opinion, this fight, in terms of show, is one of the best Bowser fights. In terms of show. Not in terms of 
the concept of how you beat him. It's a chain reaction! Hold on, the click link! Did I really scream like that? Did I seriously scream like that? I'm a man! Fight, Mario! Fight! Dish of fish! Dish of fish! <coughs> Dish should finish you! I don't know. Falling on a chandelier! <laughs> Did you think I was just gonna give her to ya? You're always in my way! This is it! I'm gonna take you out! And Mario does that while falling off on chandeliers, jumps on Bowser, he jumps so high that he reaches the chain to free the princess. It's not the best Bowser fight at, at all. I just think it's one of the most epic. Looking. In terms of show. Oh, what's going on here? Hey, there's a star in the cloud. That looks like a problem. Problem solved. Oh, wait. Maybe that was a bad thing. That door doesn't look that big from here. Super Mario RPG. Actually, that sword does not appear there until you play the game. I never knew that until I recently did a, a race of it. It's in practice for that. So, um... Yeah, recently. So yeah, so we go flying because of that giant sword that got stuck in Bowser's castle. Fortunately, we land in our house. Hey Mario, lots of people use something called a door to go in and out of their houses. Well, I'm like, Sa well, I'm practically Santa Claus. I'm Mario. I'm practically Santa Claus. What do you want? It? You hear the pickup toad still since it's a bit late. Okay. And I'm stuck on my clothes rack, so you get to jump off. And welcome to Mario's pet. Those who wanted to know what Mario, where Mario lived in the 90s, this is it. Okay, this is the save block. I'm gonna overwrite file three because I don't. Nobody cares about Luigi. I do. Uh, anyway. Let's see, is there anything around here? I, I forget. Alright, so this is supposedly some kind of a 100% run, meaning I'm gonna go for hidden box, every hidden box. I'm gonna have some help with that. Yeah, let's go to Bowser's castle and get the princess back. Okay, just taking the awesomeness that is this map music for a little bit. On eight minutes so far. To Bowser's Keep We Go! It's a bit repetitive, but it's awesome. And... Whoa! Okay, I guess that sword isn't that small. <coughs> halt! Who goes there? A trespasser. This castle now belongs to us, the Smithy Gang. This is our first step to taking over this world. For nosy characters like you, we practically own this world. So see you, you deal with this. <laughs> the Mario searches over the vast wasteland toward the sword stuck in Bowser's castle. <coughs> And Mario is a master of charade. We'll see how good he is at charades soon enough. He has to be good at charades because he doesn't talk. You see, he's a good old RPG hero. 
Yeah, X. Oh, in this game, start does not do the menu. It's X. X is also cancel the menu. Let's save. I am man. Oh, whoops. What happened? Oops. <laughs> I just burped. Wait, when he said excuse me, yes. Oops, I said on a remote for a different TV. I'm using a different TV than my best TV because my best TV honestly can't. It throws off the timing because the TV is so big. Yeah, the bumping is my HP level. I don't really care, but it gives me a mushroom. That's cool. Um, I do. I don't want to run through the tutorial. It'll take more time. Yeah, I'm just so well traveled and experienced. Ack! I remember. A lot of people say Ack in this game. Yeah, I know about time tits. Let's just skip the tutorials. Mushrooms! Hooray! Save again! So I'm paranoid. To Mushroom Way! <coughs> Alright, let's get some fights, man! The timed hits I picked up from Toad! All along. Yeah, we were at 19 HP starting. I'm not timing super well. There's there's two types of timing. You can time it okay, or you can time it perfect. Really, I think. There might be more tiers than that, actually. But the better you time it, the more damage you do, and the less damage you take. Like that, see? That was a perfect timing. Oh, you can HP max. Mm-hmm. That's yeah, you can just run into enemies. Jumping on them does nothing. And there's two of them. Well, well, I'm gonna use the jump. Which is a much stronger attack. Ow. Sweet, I got two moves in a row. Oh, I got a mushroom. Cool. Nice. There's no point in using the jump on these Goombas because they only have two HP. There we go. The HP max. No match for fisticuffs. Coin. These give you coins. Or 17 coins. Woo! 17 coins! Hey, Toad, what's, 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 what's going on? Yeah, we can jump in the overworld in this game. Yeah, you can jump in a Mario game. You're so surprised. It's so shocking. Especially since his original name was Jumpman. And Donkey Kong. Alright, then we level up. It's level 2. Nice. Now, here's the thing, you can select what you want. Well, that boosts it by three. But, there's one thing that'll give you more bonuses if you pick a certain level, you pick a certain choice at different levels. In this case, at level two, you want to pick special for the optimal thing. And that's, I'm just going to go with the optimal choice every time. See, it boosts it by three. This only gets boosted by one. This gets boosted by three as well. But, we want this one. 
Because we want a lot of special attacks and physical attacks from everybody. Except for baby Bowser. But... That's for a later time. Alright. Oh yeah, our jump uses up flower points. Meaning we can't use it anymore. Flower points are the equivalent of MP. In this game. Now I'm level 2, I'm good to go. I'm just gonna fight a bunch of stuff my way. Now watch it for level 2. We take out the Koopa Troopers in one hit. Oh what, did I run into a Goomba? Yep. Dang, the music in this game is so awesome! At least I like it. Let's free you from one Koopa. Sky Troopa. Sky Troopa is his name. I also got a really good time to hit there, because I did 10 to the one before. Alright, let's look at our items for a second. Press X, press A. A is confirm, B is cancel in this game. And B is also jump. Now, here's the thing. Flower tap. Raises flower points by one. Now, this permanently raises flower points by one. But we want to save that. Because not only does it increase our maximum by one, it also maxes us out. Oh, whoops. I thought that could on accident. Okay, there we go. Now this restores our HP and flowers, which we'll get a tutorial of later. But the tutorials were- wait, wait, wait a minute. Did I forget? Yes, I did. I did forget. I am a fool. Get a flower! And that boosts our max flowers by one, but we should have gotten that before we got the mushroom. Watch out here, there's a lack of two, and there's spiny things running about. Uh-oh. Hammer brother. Hey, eh, nah, I'm not gonna voice act. You can read. Yeah, he's got a mean streak, alright. Hiya! How you like that? Damn it, time! Jump on the other one. I'm running a little experiment here. It's a little late to time that. In the defense of that, you have to wait for the star for when the stars are going to appear. There we go. Boss one down. Oh, now he uses Valor up, which raises his defense, which is why we jumped on him before. He jump! Hammer brother! We got a flower jar, which is like the flower tab, but it raises it by three. I'll bet. You do have a higher speed stat than me in most games. A hammer. Oh, it's got the Amber Rose insignia on it. No one stands a chance, huh? Well, I'll bet that's false. Oh, it might come in handy. Well, it will come in handy. Alright, let's check the time. Alright, this is a good place. But let's equip it. Go to equipment and look at it. Ooh, it raises our attack by 10. Nice. Pounds enemies. Nice. 
This looks like a good stopping place for me. So, I'm level 27 Markerman. This has been Let's Play Super Mario RPG. Join us next time when we go to Mushroom Kingdom. Thank you for watching. Bye.